We begin at five with developing news out of East Point. The city's high school goes into lockdown over reports of a threat made on social media. The building was searched and no evidence of a threat was found or any weapons. And thank goodness, because this was a pretty scary situation. Fox 2's Charlie Langton joining us live from East Point High School with the very latest there. Hi, Charlie. Yeah, hello there. Let me first off start with some good news. As Rube said, there were no injuries, no weapons found, and everything was okay. But for a couple of hours, it was very, very scary for the 490 students here at the East Point High School. It's on Gratiot near Nine Mile. Around 11.30, the police had already been at the school for another incident when the school received a call that there was a social media threat. Someone on Instagram apparently posted something that looked like some student may have had a gun. Well, the parents that lined up in front of the school waiting for something to happen, they were very nervous. Take a look. If I was growing up, we wasn't doing this. We would probably fight and get it over with, but this is too far. East Point High School on Gratiot near Nine Mile on lockdown for a few hours Wednesday afternoon because of a report that a student possibly brought a weapon to school. This is just out of hand. I don't, I'm, I'm not used to this. This is weird. Weird. 1135 Wednesday morning, East Point police get a call that a student assaulted a teacher. Well, that turned out to be not true. But when the police were at the school, there was a caller that said an Instagram video showed a student possibly with a gun inside the school. The 490 students in the school at the time were placed on lockdown. The police did a thorough search both inside and outside as parents looked on. My son being up in school with, you know, uh, someone bringing a gun to school. That's what I'm worried about. At 216, the thorough search found no weapons and students were released safely with no injuries. He's got about another week of school. He's not coming back. You're not going to let him back? No. Why not? Guns. <laughs> it's safety. Now, the search did reveal a loaded magazine, but it turned out to be from an airsoft gun, not a threat. And school is set to resume Thursday morning. Now, I'll tell you what, uh, police are still, this is an open case because police want to know who made the call to the school and who was responsible behind that Instagram video. But the bottom line here, though, although there was a, a, a magazine found, but it was from an airsoft gun, not a threat, not a problem. Now, give some credit to the police officers here, especially Warren that came in, Hazel Park, Roseville, and I think, oh, there was someone else, I forget. But they all assisted in an orderly fashion. Again, no injuries although this is an open case though they want to find out who made that school threat school as we said will continue tomorrow morning i'm live here in east point charlie langton fox 2 news